Oh. Okay, welcome to the National Show, guys. Today we have an unboxing for you. We just got our Strap 2 furniture in. Uh, nothing too crazy, but uh, yeah, I've said ah uh, so many times. How about let's get the show started? Come follow me. So just took the uh, first bar stools out. So that's how they come in. Really nicely packaged in there, so can't complain. So let's just uh, see this. Rip this off real quick. So I got the dark brown faux leather type chair. Yeah, we bar stool, counter height. Bar stool, this is a counter height. As you can see, we have a quite full counter here. Uh, and then it connects to this. And there's another piece over there, so I'm still unpacking. And uh, shall be assembling these sh soon and showing you what they look like. Hey, so uh, back again. This is the Hayden bar stool. This is uh, counter height, I think 61 centimeters. So comes in a few pieces, all alphabetical. They got the bags here, so A, B, C, D, F. So and there's, there's a manual right there. Uh, one sec. So you can see, so strap two packages, everything right there. I don't know if it's very visible. Yeah. Yeah, you got that. So alphabetical. It tells you have everything till J, and everything to expect in a to put the the cow uh, well, to put the bar stool together. So got the manual here. Got all my pieces. So I'm just going to sort of try and figure out what goes where given the manual and then probably do a time lapse it's gonna be quite boring just watching me figuring stuff out then you can see what it takes to put a bar stool together kind of like a kia you know what i should actually have put the light on because like you're so dark wrong light it doesn't matter it will still look the same it's like it's all good wow Wow. Yeah, Real just like Shreba. Real classy. Real classy. The box is a block in the light. We apologize for that. You can do a close up on your face for people to know what you look like. To smell you. But to smell me? To smell you. That's how close we're gonna get. We're gonna get crazy. What? <laughs> okay then. I shall begin. It does dun 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 dun. All right, three more to go. Three more. To go. But first, let's let's take a look at your masterpiece. Okay, put it here, there, where there's light, light, light next to the. Okay, there you go. Uh, are you gonna describe your piece of work here? So basically, we have the chair itself. This is where you put your booty. Uh, we've got the stands, they're divided in two, they're joined at the middle here with two screws and then we have these uh, supports, uh, same thing, two, one, two screws, one on each side, front and back and then to connect the chair to the frame, 
you have four bolts and uh, washers that okay. go there. So pretty easy. Took me no time whatsoever. So yeah, really great design. Really comfortable chair. Like the color. It's gonna work well with what we have here. Thank you very much. Keep working. Yes, princess. Look at that booty. Look at that booty. <laughs> Let's be as enthusiastic as those car video guys, you know? Like. From that angle, that's the profile that you're getting. Mm -hmm. Backrest, we, the backrest was a must. And the wide seating was also a must, those of the Do, do, do. Get it, get it, get it. It's too much sauce. It went off a little bit. But anyways, in the middle of our assembly, I noticed that just that part wasn't screwing on right. And then, so I unraveled it. Okay, I unscrewed it and then I discovered this. Right? And on the opposite end, it's straight. So, yeah, hubby took a look at it and it's a welding issue. So we might have to, no, we definitely have to return it. So that's just uh, a little hiccup along the way, but actually, I think that's the only thing, right? Yeah. Other than that, good. yeah, really good. But I'm not as good at assembly as my husband is, so I've struggled kidoko a little bit. But other than that, how would you rate the assembly process? Pretty easy. Uh, just gonna... <laughs> okay. I don't do like a three or four. Nothing too crazy. Anyway, so we're just gonna do a return. Hopefully they will expedite that process. 
on this one. So we just have three chairs for now. We ordered and paid for four. And that's put, that puts an end to my part of the assembly. We're almost done, right? Yeah, this is the last one. Um, you can assemble the, you can still throw the chair on it. We just don't have an extra leg support. That's, so you just have to fasten okay. this middle section pretty tight. Okay. And then when we get this piece back, they'll, they'll just replace the piece. Really. Okay. You don't have to replace the whole chair. So, quick uh, tour here real quick. Sorry. Is that right? Can you see me? Yeah, yeah, okay, you sorry. Oh yeah, yeah, I can do that. So, focus on the boy. So, quick tour here of uh, the three I've assembled so far. So far, build quality is good. Um, on some, finding a few slight, probably manufactured defects, could be just mass-produced issues, I don't know. But um, here we go. So we got uh, we got these ones, right? we got this first one, this is the first one I built, put together. As you can see, it's really solid. No wobbles, no issues, fine. Second one, it's okay, same thing. Fine, I had a few issues underneath here with one of the screws being a little bit off center, but I was able to address that, so not a big deal. With this last one though, um, I don't know if you can see that, but like it's completely. Oh, I can hear it now, one sec. How do I do this? Okay, so. This is the last chair right here, and you can see it is just completely wonky. All these others are flat to the floor. Again, no issue with the flooring, even when I move it around, it's still rocking. Something in the corner there, I don't know. Maybe it's too tight, I don't know. I'll try something, see if I can fix it. Cheers.
So guys, unboxing is continuing. Uh, For the what? Big couch, Aaron it's called. Uh, yeah, it's like a sectional. It is a sectional, it's got like a few movable parts, it's pretty cool. We'll see how that goes. Hopefully better build quality than some of the Hayden bar stools I have here. Nonetheless, that shouldn't be an issue. Structube should be able to resolve the issue. Resolve it, no problem. But um, we're gonna do a quick coffee break. Coffee I'm break. Be hungry. She's hungry. Oh, sorry. She's hungry. I keep working, and then yeah. Yeah. No, let's do a new transition. <laughs> Beast. Put these um felt oh no my battery is almost dead the felt things at the bottom cinder on the chair yeah yeah do you scratchy have your coffee yes mama break
Okay, guys, so. Like, do you wanna sit on the chair or something? Before we uh, finish off this garbage, so quick uh, rundown. We got uh, four bar stools assembled. Those two, no, those two need to go back. They got minor issues, not a big deal. These two, perfect. We really like them. They work with our theme here. Got wifey there, don't worry, we're gonna get drapes. That is a bed sheet for sure. No, we're staying with the bed sheets. Oh, we're keeping the bed sheets? Forever. That is the wifey. This is the new look. That is a new look, by the way, bed sheets for the win. So, this is the couch in our space. It's quite large. That is like, it, it works perfectly because. It fits, it fits our space perfectly. Yeah. And to end, obviously, you gotta get rid of all that stuff, but you like it. And then the backrest adjustable, I'm not even giving a quick demonstration. Yeah. So just lift and goes back. All the way. And then all the way. Gotta be. You got a big day bed. Win for me. And the middle section, all that stuff. And then moves like to this. Same thing. Then you just lift and. Boom. Move it to the back. And then I'll show you the mechanism. Okay. Which you can do. Uh, you can't really see it, One second. One second. Okay. Okay. Why don't you flip so, it over to your side so that you can see? Okay. So. This is what? Yeah, so this is kind of what it looks like. So we just got like a lift. You just lift yeah. and take Boom. it back. And again. Okay, now we're bringing it forward. Yeah, so it just pivots yeah. on that system there. Yeah, very simple. One hand design and we can have a much deeper couch. Yeah, it's a fabric. And this is like, yeah, this is some nice fabric. It's dark gray, this one. We initially had looked at the light gray, was yeah. it? Yeah, the light gray. But they didn't have that in stock for quite a while and you know, we felt this would work as well, and I quite like it actually. I think I think it works very well, considering we have a baby, and yeah. she will probably go to town making a mess on this one. So light gray would would have shown wear marks much faster. True, true, true. And we can always reupholster down the road if we're keeping this couch. Anyway, thank you very much for tuning in, Mama. Any last words, Miss Natshell? Oh, it's finally here. Thank you, Baba, for the chair, for assembling it, and uh, yeah, the patience. I'm gonna enjoy this couch, for sure. All right, signing out. Mm -hmm.